Well, welcome back everyone. The sun returning for just a little bit as we exit out of our Wednesday. We're looking at temperatures that are well above average for this time of year. 54 degrees as we speak with a calm wind out of the south around 13 miles per hour. Going to pick up just a bit as we head into the evening tonight as we see the cold front passing through and then the cold air starts to settle in. Clouds and radar shows us that we have the cloud cover around for most of the day now exiting throughout our Indiana loca uh, locations. That is compared to our Illinois counties that have been seeing a little bit more in the way of clear skies for a little longer this afternoon. Temperatures are just warm for this time of year for everybody. 57 in Casey, 58 in Effingham, 55 down in Robinson, only 57 in Flora, still hanging on to near 60 degrees. But come tonight, those temperatures are going to plummet. We're talking the return of near freezing temperatures for everybody during the overnight. That cold blast of air is going to wrap up the week for us and even by Friday, turning frigid, looking for flurries even as we head through our Friday afternoon and evening. Here's a look at your bigger picture here. We have that warm front that's now exiting off to the northeast, a trailing cold front now moving through the valley. We have some much colder and drier air working its way in on the backside of that center of low pressure that's to our north. So that's going to be the trend as that colder air starts to take over by the overnight tonight. Not a bad looking evening for us. We could still see a quick splash of rain, mainly in our northern counties through the evening tonight. I do expect most of us to stay dry though. 49 degrees at 7 p.m. dropping back to 46 by 8 and then eventually near 43 by 10 o'clock tonight overnight lows. Well, that's when it turns very chilly. We're talking near 30 degrees here in Terre Haute, right at that freezing point in Robinson down through Vincennes and 33 degrees your overnight forecast low in Lagodi. That's where we begin the day tomorrow of near 30 degrees. Here's your temperature tracker heading through our Thursday. Notice just much colder throughout the course of the day by midday only rebounding to 35 and then we are set to stay in the 30s with a high around 39 degrees. That's here in Terre Haute topping out near 39 in Casey and Paris tomorrow as well. Lower uh, parts of the valley looking to top out in the lower 40s places like Vincennes and Lagodi. So there you go. There's that big time change in temperatures nearly a 15 degrees colder than where we are today. Sky is above though for tomorrow. Here's futurecast putting us through about 5 p.m. Look to be partly cloudy, so we are going to stay dry for our Thursday. And here's a look ahead at Friday 7 a.m. We bring more clouds around, uh, more in clouds in rather. So looking ahead, that's when that colder temperature arrives, and that's when we have a little bit of excess moisture in the air. Whenever those two combine. There is a pretty decent chance that we could see at least a stray flurry or two. So I'm going to put that in the forecast at least through our Friday late afternoon and evening as that colder air sticks with us. So your forecast during the overnight tonight back near 30 with again a straight evening shower possible north and then clearing during the overnight turning much colder as well. A flurry or two possible. The coldest day in the extended forecast is going to be on Friday near 34. We break the cold by Sunday with highs rebounding back near 50 and then heading into our holiday week. Susie temperatures back above average topping out in the 50s.